welcome back to Novice Insectio with me, Eki Thump. Um, I think today what we might work on is seeing if we can get some armour or clothing of some kind produced, first of all. Because uh, we are still running around just in our our shorts there. Um, and it is... Now, we are 27 years old. It's a bit unseemly. Um, I'm not exactly sure how we do that. But let's have a look at some of these buttons. Yeah, here we go. So currently we are wearing uh, nothing. We've got a beginner's crude axe and no other clothes. So I don't know what all these mean. Uh, I assume they're size skills or something to do with that. We are very cold at the moment. So uh, let's take a look at the crafting menu, which I believe was on X. It was uh, cooking. Well, it's not going to be. Can we even? We need leather. Leather for that. How do we get leather? Well, we've got pelts. How do we get lye? Water and bark. How many pelts have I got? I did pick up a few. I've got, so, six pelts. I could make some leather. Uh, to do that, I need to gather some water. So, uh, I guess we head back down up here. Or maybe we should go... Let's go and see this lake to the, uh, to the south. See if we can find that. We stop every once in a while and gather up some uh, seeds and herbs and whatnot. What the fuck? Oh, what are these? Does. I could probably kill these and get pelts if I need them. Oh, there's another box. So look what's in this one. We've got an ancient stamina tonic. Let's take that. And some ash. Let's take that. It's not going to come... Oh, Jesus. Uh, where am I? Human 2.0. Oh, I'm here. Actually, I need to go straight west and I should find some water here. Yeah, here we are. Uh, so, I can drink this horrible shitty water. Um, no. God damn it, I've forgotten how to gather water. Uh, fill, ah, fill all with water. Okay, uh, we need to get some bark from a tree now. Right, so let's see about some leather then. Uh, leather... A leather pack is two bits of leather. So I need to make... All the lie I can. I feel like I should make a beginner's leather ch Oh, I'm going to need ingots for that. Can I not make some just some leather armour with no... No iron involved? God damn it. Oh, I can, I can tailor. Must be near a sewing station. Actually, there is a, there's something I forgot to look up. Um, I don't know how you how you get them, but there is a a crafting state. Uh, what's it called? A land claim. Somehow, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Uh, let's gather some more water anyway. Might as well since we're here.
No, press tab again. Uh, fill that up. Let's head back over here. We'll work out how to place a campfire and that sort of thing. I'm doing pretty impressively, I think. I've gone from 18 to 28 and I've not really eaten anything yet. Now, it's pretty dark around here, so I should think about getting a, a fire down. <coughs> Excuse me, a fire down. Uh, right. Let's have a look at the building menu then. Uh, a campfire. Any kindlings. Okay, let's make a branch. Stone campfire. Right, we've made one of those. Apparently. Without, it, without the fireplace is not a source of light and heat. It is also very important for the opportunity to cook a good meal. This hearth is destroyed after burning out of all the raw materials. It can be used again. Do not forget to take the ashes after burning, which also has its place in the process. Sure. Let's put a campfire there. Here we go. Uh, you're near the fireplace. If the fire burns, will be possible open via this fire a special craft window and cook something good to eat. So that'll be in cooking. Ooh, I can make some cooked roast. The basic dish of meat, just meat and a few herbs. Let's cook those. Must have more meat than I thought. How many can I make? Oh, just one more. Okay, very good. So does it tell me how much hunger I get back? Uh, 12 apples. I'm going to assume that's 12%. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, the fire's gone out. Doesn't stay lit very long. Um, right, how am I going to get a sewing station? Do I even have the uh, the skill to make that? Let's see, uh, weapon and tool smithing, workbenches, oh here we are. A sewing station, needs ingots. Okay, so that's going to be... I would assume blacksmithing. Uh, no, it just needs ore. Raw copper ore. I think we need to go and find some uh, some ores from somewhere then. I'm not sure if I can just mine from any old place or what. Oh, what's this? Mine. This is raw stone. I'm going to assume there are veins somewhere that I can mine. I'm going to guess they don't show on the map, though. Well, let's have a scout around and try and find some rocks that don't just give me raw stone. I 
have to imagine they look like special rocks. But uh, we don't really know until I try. Oh, the creative... These boxes have all refilled, I think. Or well, maybe that the original box has gone away and I've got another one. That would make more sense. I'm not sure if I've checked out that cave that's over there to the west. Let's go and have a look in there. Maybe there's some stuff in there. Oh, hang on. These rocks, oh no, they're just background rocks. They're a different, they're, I was going to say they're a different colour, but they're just... Just uh, the ground. So you can dive underwater. But watch out for the lack of oxygen, it says. Q to dive, space to emerge. Oh, this might be it. There's uh, some nodes of ore here. Or some nodes of something. What's this? Let me in the fucking cave, come on. There's like a fucking invisible wall here, I can't get to that. For fuck's sake. What about that? Ancient crystal. Requires any pickaxe. Great. Um, let's have a look. How do we make a pickaxe? Beginner's pickaxe. Needs a blade. Okay, raw stone. Production failed. Come on. So, oh, we need two blades. Okay. There we are. And some twine, which needs fibre, which needs plants. Beginner's pickaxe. Okay, now I've somehow I've got to put that onto my hot bar. So yeah, it's enough to have it on my tool belt apparently. I don't know what Ancient Crystal is going to do for me, but now I've got some. No. Nope, still won't let me into there. Ah, I've got some copper here though. It was a good shout coming to this cave, I'm quite happy with that. We'll pick the leaves off this, sure. Might as well just gather everything. Get some extra herbs. Tin as well. Copper and tin, that's bronze, isn't it? Thirty years old. Let's 
Let's get some more ancient crystal just because. And some ancient mushrooms, because why not? And you're really not going to let me get this node over here. You're actually going to keep me away from this copper ore. Yeah, there's, I don't know. I don't know if I'm meant to be able to get that, but I can't. Um, well, let's see if there's anything below the water that's worth going down there for. Press Q to dive. Oxygen allowance seems to be fairly generous. What's all this crap? Sea coral. I can drink while I'm underwater. I think I've got to be more mindful of my stamina. It does seem to consume quite a bit. This is, oh, there's another issue here. I'm not even allowed onto this island. Okay, there we go. Um, what have we got here? Oh, raw gold ore. Sweet. And now I'm... Uh, okay, a little icon popped up to tell me I'm getting a bit knackered. So let's let the stamina bar refill. Uh, right, now to... Okay, to smelt that into... Fuck off. Out of combat mode. Give me the crafting menu. I want to see how I make ingots. Uh, blacksmithing? Right, base metals. Uh, must be near a campfire or a forge. Well, we've got a campfire made. So let's head back to the closest building area. Okay, so now we know. If we're looking for metals, we're looking for little nodes that stick up out of the ground. It's not just like rocks with special colouring or something like that. There's plenty of deer in the woods beyond our our base. Oh, there's a jack o' lantern here. Bom, 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 bom. <laughs> Another one. So, as we're assuming that these are <laughs> Halloween things. We've earned uh, Halloween tokens. Christ alone knows what they're for. Must be something to do with the special event. Uh, I don't actually want to pick the rustler. I want to pick the... Oh, fine. Get the rustler out of my face. Uh, not grass. Here we are. This trophy. What was that? A wicked witch tonic. Uh, this tonic supplement, stamina to the max, thirst by 50%. Crazy pumpkin tonic, uh, stamina to the max, thirst by 10%. It's pretty cool. I mean, this game is single player only at the moment, but there is supposed to be a sort of MMO mode. Eventually. So I'm assuming they're sort of, kind of testing their systems for how these events are going to run like, in multiplayer. Having said that, remember from subsistence that uh, devs can promise multiplayer all they want, but it takes a while to come through, doesn't it? Bom, 
bomb, ba bomb. That's a very strange choice of music for that. Is that anomaly still there? No, that's gone. I think we have to go find fresh anomalies every time. It's a shame. Okay, uh, so... Okay, if, to make ingots, I apparently need to hold on to ores. So let's be a bit judicious. Let's say, okay, so we want to make... a full set of leather armour, let's say. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven ingots. So let's let's just restrict ourselves to making those seven ingots of uh, copper. Okay, so that should be all the. All the copper we need to make some leather armour. Now we've got to start getting leather packs together. So, here we go with another bit of leather. Ah, we need... Oh, god damn it. Okay, we need a... Any sewing kit. A sewing kit, not necessarily a sewing station. Um. Well, there doesn't seem to be a sewing kit here. Okay, so. Oh God. Wait, how does this work then? So we need. We're going to need an extra. Okay, an extra. Inga, uh, we're gonna need some nails. Okay, so we need to make a, a sew an ancient sewing station apparently. Nail shaft branch. I do like the way you can navigate through the tech the tech tree. Again, very planet explorers. But it feels somehow a little bit more friendly than it did there. Cloth pack, cloth, thread, fiber, plants. Jesus. Okay, how many was that? A cloth pack. One cloth pack, two bits of cloth, six bits of thread, twelve fibres. Okay, twelve fibres. Okay, oh, it's still going through, yeah. The crafting is timed. This doesn't make sense. I need the sewing station to... I need a sewing kit to make cloth. Um... Oh, here we are. Beginner's sewing kit. I knew there had to be something. Uh, so do I actually need a sewing station to make the... Leather packs. I do not. What about the armour itself? No, sweet. Uh, so let's... I guess we'll start... Yeah, we'll start off with the chest. So let's make... Three fibres. Okay, here we go. One wolf skin chest. Where's that? There it is. The 
complete set of light armor, it is possible to produce leather and fabric armor of this series. This is part of the armor that you can equip your character. Uh, equip that. Oh, that's pretty nice looking, actually. Nice, uh... Yeah, leather brigandine, or whatever you call it. Leather vest, anyway. So, I'm probably... Uh, I've got two pelts left. So, I guess leather trousers will be the next order of the day. Uh, beginner's legs, leather pack, two leather. God damn it, I need more water again. Where's the closest water, actually? Is it? No, I reckon it is closer to go slightly to the south west gonna need to find some more bottles or make some more bottles right inventory Fill all these bottles. Uh, leather working. Right, leather pack, leather. Shit, okay, no, it's two pelts for one bit of leather, apparently. Right, let's. Uh let's see if we can take on some of these deer. Oh shit, one shot. Right, pick the pelt. Uh, that's worth three. And the trophy. And some meat, some uncooked tier one meat. Right, that should do for the other one. Lie, leather. Leather pack with a sewing kit. Uh, let's see, leather working. Beginners, legs, leather. There's three fibers. Beginners, wolf and doe skin, legs. Here we go. We're slowly starting to find our way around in this game. So there we are. Uh, let's see then. Should we keep going for the rest of it? I think we should. I guess let's uh, let's make sure we keep filled up on the water. Well, anyway, we need to hunt some more does first, don't we? Die, do. There you go. Get the meats and the pelts. And a trophy. Leave nothing behind. Meets pelt. Trophy. Oh, we got an eye as well. And some bones and teeth. Is this one used up? What's this? One healing cover. Don't want to take on two wolves at once. 
Not without my full armor set. There's plenty of deer to hunt. Meat pelts. They're pretty good these, actually. Three pelts each. That's one and a half pieces of leather. Oh, there's a whole her fucking herd of them over here. Uh, okay, so how many pelts am I going to need? Let's not try and let's not overhunt if we don't have to. Um, so we've got two bits. So we're going to need five more leather packs. That's ten more bits of leather. That's twenty pelts. And we have ten so far. Meat. Pelt. Trophy. It seems to be three every time. Whoa! We managed to kill that guy just by getting our axe out. Actually, I did I did swing immediately after drawing the weapon. I guess it didn't render the animation. Oh, look, we're on a road. There's a fucking broken road here. Fucking iron knife. There's loot. I think we need one more deer. They seem to have run off. Couldn't handle me. I wonder if I get a pelt from killing this jack o' lantern thing. <laughs> uh, no. We did get a pumpkin tonic. Ah, there's one. Okay, that should be the last one we need. We'll leave that one alive to tell the tale. Right, so that should be all the pelts we need. Let's just double check. So, leather pack, so uh, five leather packs is ten leather, which means we need twenty pelts. Yeah, got all the leather we need, uh, got all the pelts we need. Now we need to gather up twenty lye. Make sure we've got enough bark. Okay, we're going to need some more bark, we're going to need a ton more water. Carnage. Uh, stop. Uh, right. Fill with water. And can we have both open at once? Here we are. Oh, yeah, we can switch to the inventory from here. Nice. Uh, can I do my action here? Yeah, fill with water. That's the production queue going through. Fill all with water. There is a trading station uh, marked on the map. We haven't been there yet, but it's, that's probably got something to do with these peck 
Novus Inceptio, Novus Inceptio, sorry, basic currency. Set max, create. So we should now be able to make 10 bits of leather. There we go. And oh, fucking blind. Leather packs. So what else are we going to need? Uh, fiber. Two, four, six, eight. No, two, four, six, seven, eight, nine fibers. Okay, we're short on plants. Plenty of stuff there. Plants are remarkably easy to come by. Some onion seeds. I don't know if these count as plants. Okay, uh, let's see, fiber. Uh, let's look at the advanced view. Plants, plants, and plants. We want to make. Oh shit, um, what was it? Nine fibers. Uh, yeah, leaves count. Let's do leaves. Apparently we only made one. We lose the create button when we switch between advanced and normal view. I'm not sure how you actually press go here on the advanced screen. Whenever I switch, whatever, let's just go that. So, that should be everything now. Chuck in the beginner's sewer kit and we make a beginner's waist. It's like fucking XCOM, all these 50% I'm missing. Come on. Boots. Gloves. I'm getting my leather working skill up a little bit though. Or armor smithing skill. Helmet. And pauldrons or shoulders as they're known in this game. First time on that one. Right, so here's all the stuff. Let's equip the belts, boots, gloves, leather hats. And let's see how the leather hat looks in particular, because they can be very hit or miss in these kinds of games. <laughs> it looks alright actually, it looks like a leather wig. It's not even showing. Um, I do look pretty kitted out. Has to be said. 
Uh, so, what else can I do in terms of weapons? Like offhands. I can make a beginner's shield. Um, that sounds like a good idea. What about weapons? Uh, I have a beginner's axe, don't I? That's this. Beginner's screwed axe stone. What about a beginner's sword? Yeah, let's make let's um try and craft a sword and shield as well. So, uh, start off then. Beginner's sword. Oh, have to be near an anvil or a forge to make this. Okay, well, we'll stick with the axe for now. What about the shield? Requires to be near anvil or forge. Uh, let's see. Beginner's anvil requires six ingots. Uh, beginner's forge it actually requires an anvil. Okay, let's drop an anvil back at camp. I assume we're going to need one. No, st go and stop getting your weapon out. You're too eager. Uh, let's see, beginner's anvil, make ingots. Make a copper anvil. Got ourselves a beginner's anvil, which we'll put down next to our beginner's campfire. Uh, this is a tool. It's best. To, oh, this is a tool. It's best to place it in the tooth in the tooth belt, in the tool belt. Does that work? Hold on. If I give me my inventory. If I just put the anvil on my tool belt, does that count? No, I actually have to put it down. Stop going into combat mode, Jesus. Uh, control 4. That does nothing. Uh, if I press Alt, oh, okay, okay, I can right-click on it out the tool belt to place it. Right, we're near the anvil. Now let's have a look. So, beginner's sword. Three blades, first of all. Just like in Minecraft, we start off with the stone sword. I'm just going to keep hammering this button until you let me do it, so you must as well let me do it. Handle, shaft, branch. Twine, fibre. Beginner's sword. Let's 
put that on the left mouse button. And put the axe on the tool belt. Now we want to make an offhand as well. We want to make a shield. Do we need to make the shield offhand's beginner's shield? We're going to need three more ingots. We have no kindlings. Three more ingots. Slowly getting up there with the metallurgy skill. You can see that on the top of the screen here is where the uh, chance of success and the required skill. So it's supposed to be skill value six in metallurgy, but we start off at one. So there you go. And uh, again, shield, we're just going to need another twine, two more fibres. Beginner's copper shield. Alright, there we go. So. Now we're going to combat mode. Uh, so we're going to defensive stance where we can't move. Shit, we're looking pretty good. This looks much better than running around in shorts with a crappy axe. Right, can I... Uh, let's get rid of this. Pick up my anvil now. Yeah. What about this campfire? Can I... I can only destroy that. Let's make sure we get all the ash. Right, um... Wait a minute, did I not put the leather hat on? Is that why I can't see it? No, I did. Okay. So, where's that trading zone it was showing me? Oh, the clone station's there. Oh, there's a trade terminal back at the cloning depot. Okay, well, um... I'm kind of running out of time for this episode, but let's head towards those ruins. Next time we'll stick our heads in there with our fresh new gear and see what it's all about. Uh, I should, just before I start, eat another roast. Oh, there's a wicked witch over there. See if I can pull one of these guys. Are, I, th I assume that number next to their name means they're only level one. I don't know why my defense is failing, whether that's a skill thing. Defensive fighting, there we go. There we go, we clanged off our shield. Right, let's get the meat and the pelt and the trophies. I feel a lot more confident now I've got a good sword and shield instead of that crappy axe. <laughs> Where's that ruin? Hmm. 
not sure what to expect from that, but let's find out next time. Uh, for now, that has been another episode of Novice in Keptio. I do hope you've enjoyed it. I've been Eki Thump. Like and subscribe if you'd like to see more gameplay of this game. It's turned out pretty sweet so far. Still early days, but I'm enjoying what I've seen. Uh, so, join me for more of this, and I'll see you next time.